What's up guys? Video Gamester here and I'm bringing you a Christmas special. This is the history of Video Gamester or as Video G Master as I used to be known as. But anyways, we'll get to that in a little bit. But right here I'm going to show you the very first video that I ever uploaded on this channel. So this video is called Annoying 11 Year Old Kid Online and I uploaded it August 2nd, 2012. And this was in, with an old friend of mine uh, named The Stupid Dolphin. And so him and I used to record the TV and play games a lot. And I mean a lot. And we uploaded a good amount of those to YouTube. You know what? After this I'm going to go check to see if they're still up there. Because that'd be really cool. That'd be really cool to watch our old videos. But anyways. What this video was about was me and him describing an, an encounter that we had with an 11 year old kid online who would scream into the microphone and all we would do was make him mad. That's what we did for fun back then. Right now we just leave people alone. But that's what we did for fun back then. Oh man, how far we've come. So this right here is the second video I uploaded and no I did not use an Elgato but Just Cause 2 had this awesome thing where it would record the screen for you and you could upload it to YouTube from there. So that was really awesome um, but it was pretty useless because it would only go out to 360p and it kind of sucked too. It would make the game slow and everything but hey I did it I mean like I said I've wanted to be a YouTuber for I don't know like 10 years now. I remember I used to play Batman games and record the screen and pretend to upload it to YouTube and pretend that people watched it, but now I'm actually doing it. Anyways, the point of this video was to show that, hey, you can dive out of a helicopter and get back in it. Unfortunately, I don't get back in it in this video. I don't think I get back in it the third video I uploaded, which is another one of these. But anyways, guys, this video is called Helicopter Dive Fail in Just Cause 2, and I uploaded it April 25th, 2013. Hey guys, it's Video G Master here. This is going to be my first video um, out of many. I'm going to be trying to get a, an Elgato soon. So yeah, as you can see, these were my beginnings. I pointed my Samsung Galaxy S3 camera at the screen and I recorded it away. And it felt great. I loved it. I loved making content and I really loved Far Cry. So I wanted to base my channel around Far Cry. As you can see now, that's not exactly what happened. but. I mean, who knows? So what I did for this video is basically I announced like, hey, I'm coming to YouTube. Subscribe now because I'm putting out a lot of content. All right. Subscribe. Okay. And um, yeah, I did. That was This was the beginning of my channel. And as you heard, my name was Video G Master back then, not Video Gamester. Uh, and I will explain why it changed uh, in a later video or as in later in this video. Um, anyways, guys, the name of this video was Far Cry 3 Map Editor Plus Future YouTube Plans, and I uploaded it September 30th, 2014. Yep, right there. There's one guy. Okay. Oh, they found me. Okay. Where is he? Ah, what a beautiful day here in Far Cry. Just kidding, it looks like garbage. But that's what the whole point of my Far Cry is. So what we're going to do is we're going to make this place as amazing as possible, this randomly generated map. Now this right here is the second Far Cry video that I've ever made regarding Pimp My Far Cry, the original series that I wanted to make. Uh, the Gaming Lemon, I was obsessed with him in 2014 and a little bit of 2015. I haven't seen his work in a while. But he inspired me to make a video like this. 
So what it was, it was just me messing around and uh, recording it, basically. I made my own house. It took me a while. Um, yeah, it, it wasn't too special because I wasn't good at comedy or speaking back then, not to say that I am now. But yeah, this was Pimp My Far Cry 2 Shark Pool, and I uploaded this on October 11th, 2014. And if you notice, it's the first video I used an Elgato on, but it's not HD, and I'll explain that later in the video. Isn't that right, Gretchen? Guys, unfortunately me and Gretchen got a divorce. I gotta keep everything though, so that's a win. Alright, so let me show you my car. So, um, this is my pet Steve. That's right, I have a human for a pet and a goat as an old wife. Okay. That's Steve, this is my German hat. What's up guys, Video G Master here, and this is my Uncharted 3 walkthrough. Uh, so, uh, let's get this started. Obviously, This right here was my first ever walkthrough. This is Uncharted 3, bald guys everywhere. I uploaded it on October 19th, 2014. And this is my Kickstarter, sort of. I think I got like 40 subs throughout this entire walkthrough. The thing is, it, it was like 30-something videos. So, of course, I was going to gain 40 subs. But, yeah, this is what kickstarted my channel. Everybody was like, okay, this guy is doing something. I'm going to subscribe to him. And let's see what happens. Meanwhile, while I was recording all the gameplay, I loved it. There was nothing else I wanted to do the entire day than to play video games. Unfortunately, due to technical stuff, I couldn't do that. And school and everything. Uh, yeah, but anyways, this was my first walkthrough right here. Look, everybody's bald. Everybody. Ooh, got hit in the nuts. Right, so where's the exit? Oh, right here. Uh oh, big bald man. How did he not hear that? Right, be careful. How do I, how do I crouch? Alright, so this right here is my second walkthrough. Granted, I did not finish this one for two reasons. One, I didn't like it, and two, my friend wanted it back. And it was his game, so it'd be stupid not to give it back when he wanted it, even if I wasn't finished with it. But uh, this is The Evil Within, Run, Do, Run, and I uploaded it on October 25th, 2014. And I was doing this at the same time that I was doing Uncharted 3, but obviously Uncharted 3 took a lot longer because I actually finished that game. Now, what this game did, it made me feel like it was okay to, you know, not finish walkthroughs. I was like, oh, it'll be okay, you know, not too many people will get mad. I mean, I'm bored of it. I'm pretty sure they'll be bored of it, too. Yeah, it made some bad habits. So, after this, I had a long string of unfinished walkthroughs. Uh, luckily, I broke that habit, and I literally just completed, like, three walkthroughs in a row. Uh, no problem. But, yeah, uh, this game was a little bit enjoyable, enjoyable at first, but nothing too special. Guys, a little creeped out by that guy. Is he down there? Oh, I thought that rag was him. So creepy. Dude, what kind of sick person does this kind of stuff? Hey, everybody. Video G Master here. And I'm bringing you some PT gameplay. As you can see all the way on the right. Alright, so every single one of you should know what this is. This is a playable teaser for the new Silent Hill games they were making, but got cancelled. Hideo Kojima ended up doing something else instead. And now we're getting something like it called Resident Evil 7, which, in fact, I did pre-order. And if everything goes well, I may play that game in VR and record my reactions. I don't know. Okay? It might be too much of a hassle, it might be too scary, and I won't want to finish it, but whatever. We'll get to that later. But this was called... PT playthrough, baby are you in there, and I uploaded it on December 29th, 2014, so right at the end of 2014, like literally two days away, and uh, so yeah, 2014 was my first year recording videos, and so that's the end of it right there. Please no. Oh, oh! 
Wait a minute. What? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. The power of Christ compels you. Wait a minute. Okay. Hey everybody, Video G Master here. Anyways, um, <clears throat> this is my 100 subscriber special, and uh, this is my survival world that I'm not doing on YouTube. This is my personal survival world that I do with a friend of mine, and uh, her and I are gonna play in a little bit. Anyways, so this is the bridge I made to the, the village, and this is my house. Okay, so back when I used to play Minecraft religiously, I had like four worlds just like this. Okay, because I'd get too good at Minecraft and then I'd start over and make my another world, but whatever. Anyways, so for my 100 subscriber special, which is what this is, I gave a tour of one of my worlds that I was playing in at the moment. And I was so proud of reaching 100 subs because I heard from some website that once you get to 100 subs, you get to 1,000 subs in the same amount of time. Obviously, that turned out not to be true. A total lie because I haven't eclipsed 360 subs in I don't know how many months. It sucks, but if I do get my VR, uh, maybe that will increase my views uh, and everything. And uh, I'm also going to add a, re like a reaction camera to my videos, uh, see if that does anything. But yeah, I was super excited. And so what I did is I just gave a tour of my house and all that. And this was called Thanks for Everything, 100 subscriber video, Minecraft tour. And I uploaded it on January 4th, 2015. So, right into the new year. But now we have two of these who just stare at me. Um, this used to be my friend's room, but now it's an enchantment room. Um, oh, this is our guardian tower over here. Uh, we have a bunch of... There used to be, like, so many things in here, but I took the coal and iron and I put some down in the... In the Mining. All right, everybody. Um, here we is. No, here we are with Bioshock, who won the contest. Well, not really much of a contest. It was more of a more of a rape. Here we are to my third walkthrough, but this one I actually finished, uh, and this was called Bioshock walkthrough uh, too soon, something like that. And uh, it was uploaded on January 6th, 2015, so right after I hit 100 subs. I think right here I had like 102 subs. Um, but yeah, I had a contest to see who would win between Bioshock and Dead Space. Oh, thank goodness, Bioshock won. Goodness gracious. And uh, so yeah, I ended up playing Bioshock. Can I play now? Okay. Should be able to play. Yep. You all right, boy? First time plasma, the real kick from a mule. But there's nothing like a fistful of lightning now, is there? Nope. I missed. Can't believe I missed. Oh yeah, part of the plane. What's up guys? You already know who it is and you already know what this is. So uh... Yeah, let's get right into this. Alright, so me being the genius that I am, I decided to play Bioshock 2 right after I finished Bioshock 1. Uh, this was Bioshock 2, The Adventure Begins, and I uploaded it April 7th, 2015. And uh, it was okay. It wasn't as fun as the first one. I sure as heck didn't have fun with this one. That's why I never finished it. But, you know, like I said, I had a lot of walkthroughs that I didn't finish. I think th this was the last one that I decided not to finish. The rest of them I just finished. So yeah, this takes place in the same uh, area that Bioshock 1 did. You'll see some of the same places, but y it'll be a lot different. Like, there'll be more coral around it. This is just like a basically ruined... Um, what was that place called again? I don't remember. I just played it. What's up, guys? Video G Master here, and I'm just bringing you some more FIFA. And the biggest update that will ever come to this channel. So this right here was one of the biggest updates that I had for this channel, like, basically ever. What it was, it was me changing my YouTube name. I changed it from Video G Master to Video Gamester. By the way, let me know in the comment section below if you've been here since Video G Master, because that'd be really cool. Uh, 
Yeah, it changed everything. I put it in the video called uh, Biggest Update Ever, FIFA 15 being road to average. Uh, and I uploaded it April 8th, 2015. Uh, all my like logos and stuff, they're all gonna be different. It's not gonna say Video G Master anymore. Uh, neither is my channel name I'm going to be that. The only thing I wanted to change about my channel is the name, that's it. That's all I feel like I wanna change. So hopefully you guys agree with me on this decision. Um, and yeah. Second and ten. I think I got my swagger back. Turn my mic up. Turn my mic up. And as you can tell, this right here was the first HD video I ever posted on my YouTube channel. Right here. I think I got my swagger back and I uploaded it on May 13th, 2015. And this by far has the most views uh, on my channel. I think right now it has close to 12,000 views. I have no idea what got it so many views, but if I did, I would do that every single video. Every single one. Yeah, the only reason this video was short because this guy quit like halfway through and I absolutely dominated him. And I put some cool music on it, I guess. And yeah, that's why it was so successful. Uh, other than that, I, I don't know, there's some secret that I don't know about, but, yeah, this video was, uh, really helped me out. Get open, he's gonna get lucky, and look at this, he just threw it right there, it's like my safeties aren't, like, existing at all. Anyways, on his first position, he gets a touchdown by throwing it into coverage and manually using it, as always, but our first play of the game on offense, I see that... He's got no defenders on the left side, so I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna run this counter right here. And then could I take it all the way? Sup, guys? Video Games to here, and I'm just bringing you my next walkthrough. Uh, so yeah, this game is called The Unfinished Swan. So this game right here was beautiful. It was called The Unfinished Swan. Uh, it was free a while ago, uh, but I uploaded my first video of it May 24th, 2015, and it was called uh, A Gigantic Nope. Because there was a giant sea monster in there that I didn't want to... Hell no. But this game was so good. It, it only took me about an hour and ten minutes to finish. Uh, but it was a great hour and ten minutes. The story was amazing. It felt like a children's book. That was so good. So good. Uh, I don't know why that balloon's on the bottom left. but So yeah, you press X to jump. And R1 to throw that. And this is how you find your way around for the beginning part of the game. Which is paint splatters. You find out where the walls are. Okay, so it looks like there's a corner right there. Yeah. This game is supposed to be a lot more populated than the last. And a lot bigger. Five times the size is what I've heard. It took just 24 hours for us to lose control of the city. Willingly. Tonight. Gotham's relying on one man to save us all. The Batman. So, no secret, Batman Arkham Knight. This game was incredible. It's too bad I didn't finish it. I was actually going to go back and finish it, but when I finished the walkthrough, I kept playing and not recording it, unfortunately. But, um, yeah, this game was amazing. Uh, the first video I uploaded it uh, was... Uh, on January 27th, 2015, and it was called It's Here, because I was super excited. I love Batman. I'm looking at it right now on my window. Uh, when I first moved to this house, I wrote The Batcave in marker on my window, and that was five years ago, and it's still there. Yeah, it's still there. I can't get it off now, though, but yeah, it's still there. I was right. You see, I was right, and I was a complete guess. I'm telling you, that was a complete guess, I promise. Oh crap, I don't have it. Uh, I just grabbed the op and save. Save armor, save op. I'm throwing smoke. Oh, wow, that's a perfect smoke. Counter terrorists win. That microwave was expensive. So after the Batman Arkham Knight walkthrough, I sold my Elgato and didn't upload any videos using the Elgato anymore. 
uh, just because I got sick of it. I, I don't know. I don't know what happened to me. I just didn't want to. Uh, but yeah, then I just started uploading CSGO videos, just CSGO videos only for several months. Uh, my viewers got pretty bored of that. Let me tell you, I lost a couple. Uh, well, not like a couple, more like hands full, handfuls of viewers. But yeah, uh, I just played CSGO. That was it. I wasn't very good at it. I tried playing it for the first time in nine months uh, yesterday or the day before. And uh, yeah, it sucked. I sucked really bad. Did you? The last time I stare or... <laughs> Oh, good try. What's up, guys? Video Gamester here, and I am back with more Madden gameplay. This time on Mutt on Madden 16. So as you see, I, we have an even 88. All right, guys. This is where it gets really, really tricky. There's gonna be a lot of numbers and a lot of dates in this section. So you know, I only uploaded videos of CS:GO until December 16th and then from December 17th until the 22nd I didn't upload anything and on the 22nd I uploaded me playing a very organized thief which is a computer game and then on April 1st that's when I got my Elgato 2016 April 1st 2016 that's when I uploaded my first Madden video so I already had an Elgato sold it now I got another one so I have put up a Madden video and then from April 1st all the way to May 4th, 2016, I only uploaded Madden, nothing else, just straight up Madden. And then I got really bored of that, and I started uploading actual walkthroughs again. Uh, I still uploaded a little bit of Madden, but mainly walkthroughs. But yeah, this video was my second Madden video that I uploaded in a while. Uh, the first one was just comparing my Madden 15 and uh, 16 teams on Mutt, uh, nothing too special. And uh, in this video, it was a playoff game. This guy had a much better team than I did, but I ended up coming out with the win just because. Yeah, I was I was a pretty decent Madden player. Yeah, pretty decent, yeah. You think that he doesn't get in there, but he does get in there with this one. So, yeah, there we go. Five plays, touchdown. So I'm like, okay, I'm just going to, you know, try to run out the clock, make this not a horrible beating, even though this is my wild card game. But then I run it with Thomas Rawls. I'm like, you know what? I have a good team, too. What's up guys, Video Gamester here, and I'm bringing you some Uncharted 4. Yeah, let's continue. Alright, every single one of you should know what this is. This is my Uncharted 4 walkthrough. Uh, the video I have up right now is, um, here we are, and it's it was uploaded on May 13th, 2016. So, here we are, our year, finally. And this game was amazing. Probably the best game I've ever walked through. Uh... Yeah, as you can see there, I messed up. But you can also hear how bad my microphone was. That's because my computer was so loud when it came to, like, the fan and everything. I had to put, like, a uh, noise reducer on my microphone, and it just made my voice sound terrible. Now, luckily, I just cover the computer with a bunch of crap, like a shirt or a towel or something, and it doesn't make as much noise. But you get to hear my voice better, and everything's a lot better. But, yeah, this game was incredible. Uh, and I can't wait. They just announced Uncharted The Lost Legacy a while ago. I watched it today and I was out. I was, it blew my mind. I started jumping up and down. I was so happy. You better believe I'm getting it when that game drops. You better believe. You best believe. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Congratulations. You just played yourself. This is so sick. This reminds me of a uh, Black Flag. Oh my gosh, they played themselves again and them too. This game adds a lot of like open world features to it. What's up, guys? Video Games to here, and I'm bringing you the new walkthrough. Um, yeah, Outlast. So I felt like playing a scary game. Because uh, I haven't played a scary game yet except for Resident Evil 7. Alright, so this right here is Outlast. And I uploaded the first four videos of this on September 12th, 2016. The first one was called I Don't Like This. Uh, and this was the first horror game that I played on my channel as a walkthrough. I know I played short horror games earlier. Uh, Until Dawn is the second one. And then hopefully Resident Evil 7 will be the third one. 
Maybe I'll play that in VR. Who knows? Maybe I'll spice things up. But, yeah, so this game was a little bit scary. Not too much. It was more su suspenseful than scary. Um, but it was great. It was super short, but it was great. I came home from work every day like, oh, I can't wait to record Outlast. Uh, this was when I started like doing longer walkthrough videos. In Uncharted 3, as long as they got, was like 50 minutes. And then this, some of these were like two hours. Um, as in recording sessions. Uh, but yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed this game. But the whole premise of it was to just get out. And then every time one way didn't work, you had to do the other one. But they did that pretty well. Uh, there was a lot of objectives that you had to do and all that. And they see they put everything well together. Are these actual heads? These are actual heads? I don't mind if I do. I'm going back where I... Had to tell me twice, is this a torso? This is a torso. No, we must continue because it's a game. Hold on, now I'm too cold. One second. What's up, guys? Video Games are here, and I'm bringing the new walkthrough. This is one of my favorite games of all time. Hands down. The first time I played it, I beat it in like a week or two. Cause I so as you just heard, this is one of my favorite games of all time. This is Resident Evil 4. Uh, I played this. The first video I uploaded on this was called Damn Europeans. Uh, I put it up on October 2nd, 2016. So we're getting very close to the date we are at now. But I had a lot of fun with this game. Especially the second time I was playing it when I actually did the walkthrough. Uh, because I didn't have to play any of the bosses because of a little cheat I found. Uh, but yeah, it was so much fun. Uh, I guess if you could call this a horror game. I don't really call it a horror game. I call it an action adventure. Because uh, it's not very scary whatsoever. I think there was only one pop-up that actually scared me this entire game. But yeah, this game was very long. It was super worth it. Um, and I enjoyed every second of it. Don't even have anything in them. Like nothing whatsoever. It sucks. That's not what it was like for me. Almost every crate had everything or er, stuff in it on the PS3. What's up, guys? Video Games are here, and I'm bringing you some more of the Until Dawn story. You know, I think it's really cool. Now I realize they put that there just in case. Well, obviously, just in case you forget, but they put that there uh, every time you start up the game, so it doesn't go by chapter. It just goes by when you start the game up again. And last but not least, the most recent walkthrough that I finished, um, Until Dawn. This was one of the horror games that I played. Honestly, it didn't really scare me that much. So I don't know if you could call it horror more than just like a... Like a... I don't, I don't, I don't friggin' know. Uh, but... Yeah, it was it was good. It was suspenseful. Uh, I liked the story more than I liked the jump scares. Because I honestly like horror games a lot. Mainly because I don't really get scared at them. Uh, but I just like to see what happens. Uh... Personal story, I just got, well, Thursday, so tonight, or tonight's Saturday night, Thursday night, I was watching a horror, movies at, a horror movie at a Christmas party, and I wasn't really jumping at all or looking away, everybody was, uh, I'm just used to it, I guess, with all those hours I put into Dead Space 1 and 2 and 3, um, yeah, anyways, the first video I uploaded on this was called Just a Prank, and I uploaded it November 9th, 2016, so we're getting very, very close to where we are at now. Emily looked like that girl from that TV show about a supermarket. What is it called? Like the market or something? Yeah. It's kind of like The Office. I haven't seen it. It looks kind of good, but I don't watch TV too often. What's up, guys? Video Games are here, and I'm bringing you some more of the Resident Evil 7 demo. The Midnight version. So, I haven't... I deleted this game. I looked for it for hours on the store, and I couldn't find it, so I just... Um... Anyways, I got it. It doesn't matter how I got it, but I got it. And here we go, the last video, Resident Evil 7. This video is called The Hell Is That, and I uploaded it December 9th, 2016. So very, very close to what we're at. This is not the latest video I posted, obviously. Uh, I just finally, finally found another walkthrough to do. Uh, you can go ahead and check on that on my channel. But yeah, it took me from December 9th to December 23rd to figure out what to do. Because I had zero, I had no clue what to do. I was like, okay, I got to find a game. I got to go to GameStop. I got to go in the store. I got to find something, just something. Uh, anyways, they put Mirror's Edge up for like 11 bucks or 12 bucks or something like that. I'm like, okay, Yanks, Steel. I like that. Uh, so I just, I bought it. And that's my next walkthrough. Anyways, this game is really, really good. I like it. 
Uh, hopefully, if I get my VR tomorrow, because this is Christmas Eve that I'm uh, editing this. Um, hopefully, if I get my VR tomorrow, I'll be playing it in VR. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, it looks super scary. I have it pre-ordered. I think I already said that, but I am super excited. Um, and that was it. This is uh, my Christmas special, The History of Video Gamester. I went through 63 videos, I believe. I believe. 63 videos, I believe. I'm not sure, but I did use a ton of videos. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed it because it took a lot of work, several days of work, actually. Um, yeah, probably like a week's worth of work. It doesn't look like it, but uh, Windows Movie Maker doesn't work too well, so I had to go back and edit things and finish things, add videos, take away videos, um, you know, change the amount of time that the video is playing for. Yeah, it, it sucked, but I mean, hey, I'm putting it out for you guys. Hopefully this get my, gets my channel more views. Um, and on to the next walkthrough. Uh, have a Merry Christmas. If you don't celebrate Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever you celebrate. Hope you have a good one. Uh, and a uh, Happy New Year. Come on, cut it already. Be a man. Let's go. That should say derelict house footage, if I remember correctly. I did watch my last version um, that I put on YouTube. Okay, so now that button's green, and this Nana is still tied.